settling into the space, into this moment right here, right now. Letting go of any thoughts from yesterday or tomorrow. Just being in this now moment. Allowing yourself to become aware of your breath, the rise and fall of your chest, the expansion and contraction of your belly. Feeling the heaviness of the body. Sensing any cushions or blankets or pillows around you their softness, their support. Becoming aware of the solid stability of the earth beneath you. Starting to breathe deeply in through the nose and out through the mouth. Breathing in and exhale. Breathing in and exhale. And one more big deep breath, fill the belly. And exhale. Now you can rest your hand over your heart for a moment, setting the intention to connect to that heart space, to the energy of unconditional love that is deep within you, just waiting for you to step in, to become still and soft, to open. Imagine dropping down and in to the center of your heart, down and in, down and in. Imagining a white circular room opening up before you and all through the room beautiful sparkles of rainbow light, waves of soft teal and pink, white, blue, and gold, flowing all through this heart space like an aurora borealis. Step into the space and invite these energies to wrap around you, to flow through you, to energize you with the frequencies of unconditional love, to activate within you the spark of divine consciousness. Ask these energies to help you open and relax, feeling waves of energy knowing that you are so safe and loved in your own heart. Now imagine before you a giant violet flame at the center of the room. This violet flame reaches up 300 feet in the air, connects up to a golden source portal of light. It reaches down through the earth, down, down to the center, the giant crystal at the core of Mother Earth. It connects above and below. And the energy of unconditional love grows exponential. As the light of source, the golden frequencies which hold all the colors, all the energies of creation that are most supportive to you 
as they start to flow down to you through this connection of violet fire. They start to flow up from the core of Mother Earth, spirals of gold from her heart, her source connection, spirals of her own rainbow heart light, and a wave of the violet flame within her. And as you watch this convergence of energies, creating that clear, pure channel of connection, your own heart fire grows bigger and brighter and stronger than before. You feel waves of expansiveness, infinite possibility, expansive energies that help to melt away previous perceptions of limitation and lack and constriction. You notice in the center of the violet flame your own golden source light. You watch as the layers of the flame dance before you. Violet, magenta, lavender, indigo, diamond pink, silver blue, platinum, rainbow, white, and gold. The flame creates a toroidal field all through your heart space, filling the room with the sacred geometries of the flower of life, the sacred Merkaba. And when you are ready, you step into the fire. You step into the waves of color, sound, frequency, moving deeper and deeper until you are fully engulfed in the light and you are held in the golden flame. The light around you, creating starbursts, lotuses, roses, geometries, creating balance and harmonization as above, so below as within, so without. In the center of your heart fire, you ask this violet flame and all the frequencies here to help cleanse and purify the density, the heaviness, the old systems and structures, paradigms and beliefs, the old perceptions of reality, dissolving the false and birthing the true. You ask these energies to help dissolve any stuckness or blocks that might be holding you back from fully experiencing the possibility and the potential of your highest self, your highest consciousness made manifest in this world. You watch as the firelight weaves through you from head to toe, spreading through the chest, the back, the legs, the arms, the throat, the head up to that source portal 300 feet up and down to that core connection in Mother Earth. Your soul star four feet above you lighting up with codes 
remembrances, activations of all the hopes, wishes, and dreams of your soul. Lighting up your soul blueprint, your evolutionary path. Creating that bridge of connection from that space of spirit and quantum reality. Bridging down into your conscious awareness. Helping you to remember who you are. Helping you to remember why you're here. And helping you to feel supported every step of the journey. Reminding you that it's not about the answer. It's not about which path you take. It's about living fully. About aligning every moment with the truth within you. And moving from that place with your choices, your expressions, your creations, your thoughts, your feelings, your connections with others, your unique soul song, your divine essence here for you now. just waiting for you to open, to receive, to embody. Know that you are so loved, that all that you need is provided for. Trust in this center space. Be. Allow any flashes of light, any tingling, any heaviness. Send a wave of gratitude to all that you're experiencing. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And ask your heart, ask these energies of your sacred blueprint, the divine within you, to help you know the way beyond a shadow of a doubt. Ask this fire of your heart to help you see truth no matter what distortion or distraction may appear. Ask this light to help you be released from those old karmic cycles those contracts, vows, oaths, agreements from this lifetime and any other that are no longer serving you. Ask your heart fire to help you experience freedom, the frequency of light filled with joy. the energy of love fully expressed is freedom. Imagine it now. Imagine love and freedom flowing through you, infusing every cell, molecule, muscle, and bone. Every breath, every heartbeat, waves upon waves. Love to freedom. 
the freedom that love brings. the freedom that love is. Allow yourself to go even deeper into this light, into this energy in your heart, to help recalibrate your system to this most aligned place with your highest consciousness. Releasing any spaces, places, thoughts, residual energies into the light, into love, back to their proper place and time. Remembering that in love, there is no attachment. Imagine, what does it feel like, look like, sound like? To be wrapped in an energy of complete, unconditional love. Imagine it all around you and through you, emanating from your center pouring down to you from the light above, rising up from Mother Earth, the consciousness of love, the presence of love, the softness, the gentleness, the fierceness. What is love within you? And through you, which ways would love like to flow? Love whispers to your heart. It whispers through spirit. It pulses from the earth herself. No matter what the occurrence, love is. It cannot be chained or tamed. It can be shared. It can be forgotten. It can be misconstrued and distorted. But it cannot be changed, the essence of it. Loving awareness. And this is what your heart offers to you now. loving awareness. It is within you. And as we are held in this center space, creating those bridges of light above and below, the toroidal fields all around us, the Merkaba as a chariot of light, beginning to activate and spin 
amplifying the energies of loving awareness, the presence, the freedom, the support, the allowing. We now welcome our angels, our guides, our guardians, our support teams of highest loving consciousness to join us even closer now. We ask them to help us sense even more of that loving awareness. to share their hearts. To offer to us in the space whatever it is we most need to know, to receive, to let go. To assist us in the exponentiality of the I am and the oneness that we are. the presence of love that is, the divine consciousness that creates, that breathes through all aspects of life. Allow yourself to become aware of that exponentiality. The oneness and the individual. Invite your heart to open to receive from your guidance teams their love and support. If you wish to perceive it even more, gratitude is the doorway. Thank you, thank you, thank you. As we are held in the sacred heart space, in this pure channel of connection, we now ask to welcome specific angelic frequencies, those that can assist us with harmonizing in the most optimal way. these energies of new beginnings, of acceleration in our awareness of truth and the evolution of our consciousness. Those that can help us to navigate frequency to help us release any blocks or fears around shining our true heart light and creating from it an offering in this world. We welcome Archangel Michael
We ask Michael to amplify his energy so we can tune in to the specific frequency wave of source light, the indigo ray, that introduces themselves as Michael. This frequency, consciousness, is an angelic form of Christed light, of the compassionate heart, a warrior of love, Michael's energy brings up sparkles of blue, silver, white, and a golden sword of ultimate truth. He helps us to see beyond our limiting perceptions. He helps us to feel and know that we are protected, that our essence is protected from the distortions that have forgotten their own. He offers us a wave of loving protection of cleansing and purifying, again uplifting our frequencies, energies, molecules, and the waves of blue and gold and white, even the molecules in your body dance faster and faster. as you begin to sense the lightness, that energy of freedom, the space to flow and grow and be who you are. Michael's energy reminds us that we are safe. That there is a divine timing in all things. And that sometimes what is perceived as a falling apart, a breaking down, is in fact a breakthrough an expansion of your energy into a new place, a new realm. And what came before must fall away. Lest you be constrained by the perceptions and beliefs of the past. He shows us that we are like these beautiful golden dragon fish swimming in a small pond and we have grown so large that we need more space, we need more water. We can even hear other golden dragon fish calling to us from some far off place. And so the edges of the container of the pond or the lake must crumble so that your energy, the waters of your spirit, can begin to flow into these new channels 
these new spaces of connection that guide you, guide you. To the sea. And in these moments of transition, of movement, there are moments of expansion and contraction, much like contractions in the process of a mother giving birth. There are waves that flow, waves that lift you up and waves that take you down, showing you deeper and deeper truths of who you are and who you must be. To be fully ready, fully grown, to move into the sea, Now he opens the energy and he shows us the opening. Go. Go into the sea. Go into the giant ocean. Begin to connect and commune with those other golden dragon fish. Feel so much more space, more water more nourishment, more treasures to explore, more depths to dive, more highs to reach, to leap into the sky. He brings us this energy of ultimate support and trust in this process of rebirth. Helping us to anchor to that consciousness of loving awareness. No matter what stage of our transition, transformation may occur, is occurring, came before. It is a spiral, it is a cycle. And each time you move through from one to the next to the next, you recognize how all are connected and how every occurrence is somehow divinely architected So that you are always exactly where you're meant to be. Trust that what is meant for you cannot pass you by. Trust in that inner light that nudges you when to move and when to be still. Listen deeply in moments of silence and you will begin to hear or feel or sense the calls of the others like you, the music of their souls, the vibration that matches, and you are all just coming together with one another, for together you can create something new, even more exponential than on your own. Trust. 
trust in this, in these coming times. Trust in the love that you are. There will be many things that seem to test this faith, this connection. But remember, your essence is pure. And as you commit to connecting in this heart light, it will guide your path through any darkness or confusion. Trust that wherever you are, you are home. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you to the angelic consciousness. Thank you to the frequency of Michael and these gifts and energies and remembrance that you bestow. And now we welcome the energy of Archangel Ariel. The gatekeeper of the soul star. The angelic energy that helps us to connect to our higher consciousness, our multidimensionality and to bring it through into the physical. That space of empowerment, confidence and fierce love for ourselves and all of life. This energy is here with us tonight to bring us an activation of our soul purpose and our mission expression support in the actual embodiment of what you have called for of what you have planned of what you have dreamed into being Welcoming Ariel now, her gifts and her messages. In waves of lavender, pink and bright white, with halos of gold that form DNA spirals and infinity symbols. With bright wings like seraphim fire and a rainbow cloak. Ariel offers us not only the purpose activation, but the bridge, helping us as humans to be that divine bridge. For as humans, we are a part of Mother Earth. And as souls, we are connected to divine consciousness that flows through all living things, that flows through the stars, the planets, the galaxies, the universe. 
She helps us to balance the micro and the macro. She helps us to bring to fruition that which is truly meant for us. You wish to receive the rainbow light soul purpose activation through Angel Ariel's gift. Simply feel thank you, thank you, thank you, and it shall be so. As she places the palms of her hands together and breathes the breath of light and from her hands pours this elixir of pure creation, an energy that nourishes us, mind, body, heart, soul. Letting these droplets of golden and rainbow light to flow down through the top of the head, down through the third eye, the throat, down the spine, across the shoulders, down the arms, hands, fingertips, droplets of rainbow and gold, down through the throat, the heart, the belly, the womb, the sacral, the root, down through the hips, the thighs, knees, calves, ankle, feet, and toes, down into the earth star chakra, energizing that highest alignment, that divine bridge, droplets of activated light into that earth star. energizing the path ahead, the choices, the opportunities, the potentials. With that energy of highest timeline, highest expression, mission fulfilled, the embodiment of your divine purpose made manifest. In this space, she offers a balancing to the waters in the body, a cleansing to the blood, mineralization to the bone, in whatever way is most serving you, individually and collectively, in each moment. She offers a dissolving, a melting away of pain, discomfort, disease, imbalance. She offers a soothing balm, this elixir of life to help heal any crack any fragments, any breaks, jagged edges in the physical or energetic body fields. She 
restoring health and wellness. Opening up the channels for you to receive, to share, to give in balance. The prosperity, the abundance, the community that is required for the manifestation of loving consciousness, for the manifestation of service, of evolution, dissolving any of those old paradigms and old systems and structures, anything that you may have created or that may have been placed upon you in this lifetime or any other. She offers a reset to truth. A reset to your empowered state. A balancing of the karmic wheel and a release of the consciousness and the experiencing in waves of loving awareness, offering gratitude for the past, the present, the future, for the different lifetimes, timelines, and multidimensionalities that have helped you to be who you are. Offering gratitude Where you have it, full support to create and to be who and what you are meant to be. Let life flow. Trust that when things do not seem to flow, that it may be a redirect to something better, that it may be a timing. Trust that you will know when to wait, to develop patience, to develop discernment and resiliency. Trust that you can give and receive the love that you seek, the love that you hope for. Release the doubts that you are the only one. Release the fears that your love will be taken or misused. These old programs can be completely dissolved from your experience when you anchor in the light of love that you are and you trust in the loving awareness that is clear and sharp like the sword, cutting through the non-resonant and the distortion, returning all to its essence. The divine breathes through you. Honor that and know that you are honored. It is so.
थैंक यू थैंक यू थैंक यू Let me now welcome Archangel Uriel. Uriel in a bright white light with sparkles of silver, sky blue, hints of gold. Bright orange fire near the feet or the base of his orb of light. Massive pure white wings that are blinding to look upon. as his energy snaps crackles like lightning uriel is here to help us amplify what we have received as an individual as a collective and to be offering this to the earth herself to all living beings to every heart willing open and ready to receive Uriel's energy again brings us new clarity creativity seeing beyond the beyond fully self-contained fully resourced offering us the ability to navigate when to say yes when to say no to trust through our essence that all knowing will be made clear He offers to us and to the collective this channel of connection helping us to remember the importance of connection His gift offers a repair a repair of the forgetting a repair of the disconnect And as we receive the light like a wave of lightning energy he offers this not only to the organic energies but to any connections through technology helping us to be more balanced and buffered from the disruptions that technology can bring to our precious energy field helping us to rise above the fray to see with the eagle eye to know when to dive into the experience and when to simply witness he brings us clear vision renewed creativity new ideas new inventions new ways to heal to create art and music new ways to move our bodies to explore joy and pleasure and feeling he is a kind of fire that burns and shines like a lighthouse in the stormy skies across the sea he brings you the remembrance that you are that lighthouse for yourself and others your greatest service is to be an example of light of love of compassion to be an example of understanding the necessity for the contrast for the challenges to see that all is beautiful 
that all is part of the blessing of life and that all is here for you in the creation. Allow yourself to receive this blessing now in whatever way is right for you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you to these beautiful energies of angelic consciousness. Thank you, Michael. Thank you, Ariel. Thank you, Yuryu. Thank you to our personal angels, guides, and guardians. Thank you for being with us in our heart space. Thank you to Mother Earth, this beautiful gift of light. May we honor you. May we honor all life. May we remember that we are guardians, that we are like the trees that walk. Thank you for helping us to remember. Thank you for helping us to come together with our soul family, with our tribe. And thank you for supporting us on every level, every moment of our earth walk. And thank you to great spirit the presence of loving awareness. Thank you to great creator. Thank you for helping us to navigate our multidimensional levels of consciousness and offering us these messengers through the angelic code. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We now ask the angels to close all gateways, portals, connections, access points. Returning us to our sovereignty as required for this human experience. We ask to return the Merkaba now to its stasis state. We ask to feel that clear, pure channel of connection, the warmth, the love, the comfort of our inner heart fire, wherever we may go. Thank you. As above, so below, so be it, and so it is. Our transmission is now complete. Slowly drawing the awareness back inward, inward to that heart. Inviting these energies to be with you to integrate with grace and ease and perfect timing. Knowing that all is here for you when you need it. That you are whole. 
You are loved. You are free. Starting to breathe deeply. Becoming more aware of the body. Feeling the heaviness, the tingling in the fingers and the toes. Starting to sense the room around you, following the sound of my voice. Come back into the space, into this now moment where you are. Deep breaths. When you're ready, you can gently wiggle your fingers and your toes. Take your time, there's no rush. Lots of energy here. Make small stretches, slowly waking up the body. And when you're ready, you can open your eyes. Take a drink of water, continue to ground. 